Hi, welcome to video number two, how to release the blocks that are holding you back from getting your health back and living your best life. In the last video, I brought to you the five most common blocks that I see in my practice as a primal health coach and also in my workshops and group training, but also on all of the Facebook forums. There's a lot of people that stick to um, the primal way of living for a period of time and then fall off the wagon. Well, I wanna know what is causing us from falling off the wagon? What's in our way? We need to begin in a lifestyle that we can that we can do, that we can keep sustainable, that's doable, that's gonna you know tide us through, not just a 10 week program and then back to you know, what we were doing before. So I think that the, the missing key there is just really understanding what stories we're telling ourselves that don't serve us. So if you haven't watched video one, please go back and have a look at that. So now that you've identified which mindset blocks um, resonate with you, I just want to tell you, you know, congratulations, you are normal. Everybody has blocks in every aspect of their life, whether it be money related, relationship related, food and diet and lifestyle related. It's it's that they're there, and, and I reckon that part, the reason for of living is really just to examine these blocks as they come up and grow and develop, and that's how our lives evolve. We either carry on like that or we just stay stuck where we are now. So if you could just first of all. Just consider projecting yourself forward three years. If you stayed eating as you do now, moving as you do now, how's your life going to look? Is it going to be the life that you want? Because you only have one chance at this. So if not now, then when? So now it's time for a little reflection exercise to help you break free from those mindsets that hold you back. So what I want you to do is to grab a pen and paper and answer the questions that I'm going to pose to you. Now, don't worry about thinking about the perfect answer or getting it right, just do it. Just write down whatever comes out. It might be a bit uncomfortable because, you know, we're bringing up stuff that we've shoved down for years and years and years. It might be slightly unsettling. So set aside some quiet time to do this at a time when you hopefully are not gonna be disturbed um, and you can really, you know, just feel what comes up and deal with this. All right, have you got your pen and paper? Okay, I'll wait. Press pause, I'll still be here when you get back. Okay. So the first question is, what do you need to let go of? Press pause, write down your answer. Question number two, what needs to take place in order for you to get your health back? Press pause. And this one's a good one. Question number three, there's only four. There's not much work. Question number three, how do you want your life to look? So let's start with your health. How do you want your health to look? Let's go three years from here, okay? Three years time. How do you want your health to look? How do you want your body to look? How do your finances look? How's your home life? How are your friends and family? And how do you spend time with them? Press pause and just write down your ideal future. And question number four, is what beliefs do you truly want to believe in? Apart from other people's or society's expectations, which really what we covered in, in video one was that we start off as empty little pure vessels, totally connected to all that is. And then as we go through life, we take on information and create stories that we tell ourselves over and over again. And some of those stories can be really helpful and some of them can be quite sabotaging. So. Think about now, what beliefs do you really, truly want to believe in? And write those down. Okay, done. Phew, well, not too bad. Look out for video three, where I am gonna show you how to, um, I'm gonna show you a couple of really powerful techniques to help you deal with any of that stuff that you've written down or stuff that's come up and how to break through. So you can get your health back and live your best life yet. Now, I have a Facebook page called Primal Alternative. I would love you to go over there and um, give my page a like. That, therefore, you'll be able to keep up with all of the um, great content that I've got for free on how to live your best primal lifestyle yet. I also have uh, an online community called The Primal Alternative, 
which is a beautiful group of women who are on this journey together, who are experiencing the same, the same mindset blocks as you and I. And we really, it's a real like collaborative sisterhood in there. Um, no judgment, everybody's coming from a place of love and understanding. So if you want to get in there and ask questions, you know, ask questions on what's, what can we have for dinner tonight or how can I move my body today, right through to more sort of complex um, stuff around your emotions and feelings, then please jump into that community and I'll be in there. I'd love to chat to you more there. So I will see you soon for video three.